up y'all this is critic and today <laughs> man it's early in the morning i'm tired right now as y'all can see i got this hoodie right here this big ass hoodie man i'm trying to feel comfortable I'm trying to feel warm even though it's about to be a little bit warm outside you know like 69 degrees and <laughs> you barely get that in philly but anyways we're gonna be reacting to miss marvel now miss marvel they've been marvel been talking about it for like a couple months a couple years now you know we just had a uh, wandavision last year we had um, Loki, What If, Hawkeye, and now we have Miss Marvel. I don't know much about her, but what I do know is that she's like, um, you know how like Superman has Superboy and then like Batman has, you know, Nightwing, Red Hood. Miss Marvel is kind of like that, except she's doing her own thing and she got her own powers. Her stretchy powers, which is like Mr. Fantastic, but more OP. So it's going to be really interesting to see how they go with this story. And yeah, I'm really excited to see it because Marvel, well, besides, uh, you know what, all of them been good, but they haven't been like up to par, you know what I mean? But Miss Marvel, we should see what's going on with this, all right? So before we do that, make sure you like this video and subscribe to the channel. All right, let's. I know damn well they ain't put the weekend blinding lights here. Okay, so first off, I just want to say, I get it. You get what? High school. Kamala. Kamala. Another adventure shirt. Cute. That's hot. They put the weekend song on here. I like that. I like that. I like that. She thinks I'm some kind of weirdo. You were a weirdo. Boy, it's probably a racist. Excuse me. Yeah. <laughs> you're kind of on my shirt. Sorry. But you're staring out the window in your little fantasy land. That is cute. Kamala, hey, already? Really? <laughs> on, like, do I have to figure out my whole future before yo. lunch or is like, You know what I'm getting? I'm getting like an um, iCarly right. mixed with Shazam so type of feel with this show right now. And like how they put in her religion and stuff on here. That does not like cute. that. It's not really the brown girls from Jersey City. I show You're some representation. That's a fantasy too. Oh, that was a high time. Did something happen to you? You know why? Did you hear something? Kamala? What does it feel like? Uh, this this oh, looks this nice. like a bigger budget than the other show. Fly if I did thought I wanted this kind of life. But I never imagined any of this. Okay, Mark. You know what you are. Nah, I don't really like that power. <laughs> All right, that was good. All right, tune in. I like that shot. She, she looks like she's from Toronto or something. I don't know. The Miss Marvel official trailer, and it looks like it has a bigger budget than all the shows that we watched so far. Looks like the effects are there. Uh, it looks like it's inspired like a mix of our Carly Ness Declassified. Also Shazam, you know, all them coming of age stories that we've seen so far in on movies and television and all that. The only thing I didn't like was the way they represent her powers. Her powers is supposed to be like stretchy. And I know like it could look goofy on screen, but y'all you, gotta make it work. Y'all marvel. Y'all make every y'all make a raccoon talk work. In a talking tree. Y'all should be able to show her stretching powers. Her powers look like it's like green lanterns and I don't know how I feel about that. You know, but other than that, I'm like what I'm seeing. I like how they showing her, you know, her upbringing, her family, her religion. Like we need, we need to look at different perspectives when it comes to movies and stuff, because movies and shows make us understand, you know, pe other people's perspective. Because we only have, we only know our own perspective, and we don't know any other anybody else's but our own. So it was cool to see in a, in, the, in the superhero show that we'll be able to know more about her, her powers and her family and all that. So, and I hope they show, uh, uh, they might show Captain Marvel there. Probably the other, uh, they're probably gonna show Monica Rambeau, but we'll see what happens. So yeah, it looks like it's gonna be cool. Looks like it's gonna be really fun. Kids are gonna really love this and yeah, I'm gonna be watching it. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna be, and I like that they put the weekend song on. Which makes me think that they are in Toronto. So, yeah. 
So that's basically it for my reaction for Miss Marvel. Make sure to like this video, comment down below your thoughts on the Miss Marvel trailer. If you enjoyed it or not, tell me your uh, favorites or your dislikes, let me know. Also subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell to be the first to see my new content. All right, y'all. Peace.